Hello, ladies, gents, and dirty pigs wallowing in filth! We return to Rimworld Land. Pass some time because I want the shield to be completed. We are finally building some shields. And once everybody's nicely healed, it is time to finally form that caravan that is going to go out and fetch the problem solver, the hallowed weapon that shall solve all our problems through violence. <laughs> Did we ever get that? Yeah, we got the standard mech. Why do I not have mech related buildings? How dare I be this incompetent? Get those chargers up. Get everything ready. We have plenty of steel. We have decent amount of steel. We're going to need more steel. Get some more biotech going on over here. Let's get a large mech charger to start with. We are going to need a sub... Holy crap, that takes so much junk. <laughs> We're going to need a scanner for us to be able to get more people's brains and be able to make them into mechs and we're going to need a giant gestator to be able to um, you know gestate mechs that is the way it works look at the pile of components how dare you remove my selection pile of components necessary is out of the control if Indamus is getting his lung his kidney whatever the hell I gave him uh, definitely we want more steel now we gotta mine this for sure. Mm, let's get ourselves more steel. Was that the closest I can do? Probably there's something closer than that. I think this area is slightly closer. Not like it matters too much, but mine that out. So this is even more over here. Another fat vein, and then there's another vein over here. All right, we're going to mine all that. Which reminds me, we are going to make a role change. Everybody's mostly available, right? The role is Spelunker, and it will be Lego My Mego. She's going to go in there. There's a... Not Keeper of the Flesh. What are you doing? Mining Command must be a Techno Glutton Skill Mining 6. Mining Speed plus 70%, but then they won't be able to construct, grow... Or basically do anything other than haul. Is it worth the trade-off? I have my doubts, but we're going to go for it anyway. Let's do it. Lego My Mego shall be our official... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Our official drill mistress. She's going to drill the crap out of this place. And... Um, Basically, we, our only job will be to mine everything, which kind of means that work, work, work. Where's the work? I can deprioritize the mining on everybody else. Fathead nerd, how about you concentrate on the crafting? You can still mine, but whenever it's only strictly necessary. And then we'll eventually have a drill arm. Mego, my Mego, you're late to your own freaking party. Come on, Meg. Get on with the program. Holy crap, what is going on? Trick Kraven is leaving. Detective log inside. Crack the back bay. It's fully healed. All right. She's giving a speech about, oh, gonna take that pickaxe, going to shove it right into those metal veins. You're going to watch me do amazing things. That reminds me also, we don't have a ranged person specialist. I really should have one. What does it take? Let me once more go to role change and see avatar of vengeance he's a marksman command must be the blah blah uh, he can no longer cook build grow mine plant could smith like only shooting huh who is my most worthless person <laughs> like uh let's see bio certainly not blario certainly not ragman banana is a good it's a good uh, a candidate. Because I think you can you can still hunt and you can still uh, deal with animals. Let's do more more genes. Genes forever. 
because I do want to build a, a bit of a gene bank. Mm. I was looking at it. Let me look at it again. Does it take out... Does it take out... No. Animal handling. You can still do that. Doesn't take it away. So I think banana is the perfect candidate for this. Let's check out the other people. Because all he really does is handle the animals and then shoot the crap out of everybody. Certainly don't want T-Rose to lose her cooking. Hike is very uh, high in construction. He's a, a big builder. Break soul. He's a big artist. He's a crafter, so not going to want to lose that. F and Damis is our main tree hugger, so definitely don't want to lose that. Crack like Vagve. Melee specialist and intellectual. There's no reason you should go for that. Melee specialist here. We also have Grave Digger. It's also a good candidate, but it's a good warden, which also doesn't matter, right? I think... I think I am much... Either Banana or Grave Digger will be a fantastic candidate for this. Even Dregs. But Dregs is such a newcomer, not even converted to our... To our cult. Let's just do it right now. No, not execution. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, different ceremony whenever they piss me off. Let's go, banana. You're going to be our new avatar of vengeance. Let's begin. Let's see. Cook, construct, grow, mine, plant, cut, smith, tailor, craft. He does none of those things already. So, yes, we're going to have... A shooting specialist. It does interrupt the work from everybody else. Kind of annoying. Why is the... Okay, his, his speech is happening, all right. A bit of a waste of time for everybody involved. Like, oh, another meeting? Couldn't this be, have been handled in an email? Come on. No, Banana now is our shooting specialist marksman command. How about this? I don't think I've ever used this. Call out shots and boost the shooting skills of everyone nearby. The effect remains... So basically, it just boosts the shooting ability of everybody that is nearby. All right, looking great. Great advancements. Let's go to the world. We're going to form a caravan. We're going to go over here. And we're going to... Let me uh, put a little bit of thought into it. You know, I really liked sending the dogmen out. They thought that it was pretty damn cool. So let's send out the dirty... Filthy furries out into the mission again. Three people should be enough to get accomplish this. One of which wielding a steel, an excellent steel gladius. Although maybe instead of Dermeister, maybe have Meg go out with her excellent uranium maze. Oh no, but her melee ability is pretty trash. Yeah, we'll do it like this. May even send Ragman with them to make all the enemies blind? Is, what is Ragman's actual role? He builds things. Let's just leave him behind. He's too, way too valuable. All right, let's just send this over. Plenty of food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, at last we got that caravan going. Hopefully it won't be a nightmare of mechs defending, defending this stuff. Do I not have it? Yeah, I do have a caravan hitching spot. Great stuff. Um, now we need to find ourselves a drill arm for Meg. Oh. Yeah, okay. Uh, the caravan has, fo has formed. So, I need to keep these people safe, right? Right, but... Can't I just scan them real good? <laughs> Put them in the scanner, get myself a, a prisoner brain? start the scanner at the very least we're gonna get tubo in there get ourselves because the way it works you start this up then you put a person in there and you scan their brain to be able to create mechs with it it's pretty damn cool entire mech mechanics pretty neat all right let's get some time going forward maybe you know it should have been blargo going out there finding the incredible relic it's just not right to send some filthy, low-class imbeciles to do the job of a leader. But why not? Why not? The dogmen are totally trustworthy. We got a new Ambrosia Sprite 
basically free money. Let's get that like so. And then say, do not sow. Do not sow. And then you shrink the growing zone to an abomination. No, like so. Oh, beautiful. And it shall be harvested when in, the, in, in due time it shall be done. Banana, Dermeister, and Gravedigger are approaching the relic. Let's see. Let's see what, what it looks like. There's the complex. Um, yeah, there, there are enemies outside and they are all awake. That is the problem with the fact that we allowed it to take this long. Maybe this require one more person. Because this can be a problem, this Tesseron son of a bitch. If we can maybe approach him from a good dist from you know uh, get be able to get close enough. For now though, we're gonna go up this way, try to kill the militars. Oh wow, the scyther is just charging, huh? They didn't realize that they were so ready to obliterate me. Get that marksman command already. Pow, 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 pow. Well done. Well done, banana. So that means that the Tesseron, yeah, the Tesseron is coming right up to us. What's the range on this son of a bitch? I really want the Scyther to go down, but let's just send out the animals. Ah! Yep, yep, yep. The animals are gonna take all the heat in the most literal way possible do they does banana reach yeah yeah just shoot down the that tesseron it's a problem this is uh concerning did they come out i think they came out because with the the monsters the animals on fire <laughs> it's uh makes this a little bit more challenging okay there my sir just go hang back hang back Oh, move! <laughs> oh no, you idiot! I hate that. I hate how RimWorld does that. When you're drafted and you get out of the map and you click on the area. Where is he though? Uh, you. Oh, that is so obnoxious. <laughs> I mean, he could go in there and grab the relic and then flee with it. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, he needs to, he needs to join the fray, maybe charge from the back, look at him, being so smart. Ruffle Stump, you're not assigned, aren't you? Yeah, that's what's going on, assigned to Banana, so that way they can charge. There you go, now you're charging. Third monster, uh, not great, <laughs> not great in the slightest, this is also a problem, like, we're gonna have a bad time. Are there animals we can use here? Animal war call. Surely there's more animals. This rat will be my... My ally. There you go. Maybe they're a meister. There's a lot of animals. They're just boars though. There's some donkeys. A wabbit. Nothing big. The boom rat can be useful, but mechs are immune to fire. Let's get this donkey into the fray. I'm a little concerned. This may be a bad idea, what I have done. What? Oh, logging. Logging works out. All right, some more war calls going on. Spread out. Oh, no! Shit! <laughs> Flee! Flee! Oh, this is, this is really bad. I didn't realize that this would be so painful. Extinguish the fire and turn monster. We need some some uh, melee damage going on here. That Tesseron is absolutely destroying me. We may need to flee. But then that leaves the animals behind. This is, like, awful. I think it's time immediately we're going to form world 
I have gravely underestimated, gravely underestimated the threat that they would be in this place. Let's take it as seriously as this needs to be taken. We're going to take the, the death squad in there. They're going to jump in there with as many elephants as possible. My bad, my bad. I have gravely underestimated this. Uh, the caravan should be... Yeah, that's fine. That, this this amount of meals, whatever you want to take. Take 10 herbal medicine. Probably like 15. There's going to be so many wounds to treat. All right. We only have two... Uh, two... Sleeping bags. Now, this is awful. Please, Ruffle Stump, go and attack <laughs> my beautiful squirrel. Okay, turd monster, charge! <laughs> Did not, don't tend to Grave Digger. Is he incapable of firefighting? I hate when the game suddenly decides I'm not going to let you extinguish fire. All right, please. Attack that needle there, I suppose. Oh yeah, Ruffle Stump got into a fight. That's good. Oh. Awesome. Now, the Tesseron needs to go down. The Tesseron is the most important thing. Out of range, huh? Holy crap, everything's getting burnt down. <laughs> uh, I'm too far. Okay, you can shoot at the fire. Shoot at the fire boy. Actually, the fire creatures are also needing to uh, be put down. Oh, this is awful. This is absolutely terrible. <laughs> is the Tesseron getting hit? Oh yeah, okay. The Tesseron is going to go down with this shot. Nope. When another one goes down. We may be able to salvage this. If Banana lands this hit. Oh, come on. Get out of there. Please, banana. I can't believe it. Completely missed. Completely freaking missed. Move. Bring them down. How is how's Dermeister doing? Not great. Not great. Has been getting bonked down in the head. And uh, where's my donkey? The donkeys are doing absolutely nothing. Amazing. Not not the greatest thing. Blargo, you're, you guys are not even started, huh? Banana is going to be on fire. Oh! The Tesseron. Please bring it down. Oh, it's down. All right. Dirtmeister is down down there. Uh, we may need to right-click out of this damn place. He's only bruised, right, Dermeister? He's only bruised. He will not die. <sighs> Let's go. Let's get out of here. I don't think we can survive this. Extinguish the fire on Grave Digger and see. Okay, he's actually not on fire. So, just right-click out. Move. Oh. Please! Ah! <laughs> Son of a bitch! <laughs> Grave Digger is on fire. Come on. You can do it. Stop. Stop roaming. Quick. <laughs> Get to the corner. Alright, alright. They survived. They survived. Caravan lost. Captured by ancients? You don't just let, let the... Okay, well... Live and learn. Live and learn, I suppose, because uh, you guys can just rest. Oh, that was terrible. That was freaking shameful. I really hope that these get attended. Uh, Banana cannot even do doctoring, can he? Okay, somebody did doctoring here. <laughs> Hopefully. Okay, it, it, it did get doctored. All right. This is taking for... What is going on? Everybody needs to get to the damn to the damn caravan. These guys are just going to get tended, hopefully. Okay, they did get tended. The tending quality 
Not the greatest quality I have ever seen. It is extremely underestimated the kind of pain that those mechs could dole out. And this is the middle of the night. This is something also that I resent about the way that RimWorld treats caravans. You cannot make them uh, do a forced march. As far as I understand, I actually have never actually attempted it. Maybe if you assign nothing, like you go in the schedule and you assign nothing but work, maybe that's how you can get them to do a forced march through the night. Otherwise, they get they get um, bogged down. They're just out there sitting and doing nothing for the entire night. And it's like, what if the meters, they don't really need to rest, you know? They don't need sleep. They don't need rest. Move! Go and move! <laughs> Too dangerous to re-enter for 18 hours. What are you talking about? What? Why? Why Why you do this? Why you do this? <laughs> you freaking morons. 18 hours? That is unreasonable. Too, reason to, too dangerous to re-enter. That is just silly. What are you talking about? This is a situation I had never come across before because I am um, always ruffle stomping these places, but I've never actually gone where all the mechs are actually alive. Okay, I guess we'll just go up here. Developing this infection on his body. Like, oh, it's, it's just the elephant. Hopefully, neither banana nor grave digger are going to get infected here, but. They have a high likelihood of actually getting infected. Thankfully, Borlago will be there soon with them. some medicine. And then they're just going to sit idly like idiots, aren't they? Because I did not I had no idea that this existed. This entire, you, you may not merge. Merge, there you go. You may not re-enter for 10 hours. Yep, yep, grave digger. I only have herbal medicine. Bitch, I'm going to sit here for 10 hours and I'm going to go in there. Maybe we should go to the logging work site. Maybe we should go to the hunting work site. Get ourselves a bunch of wood. Oh, this is so obnoxious. <laughs> Seven hours. Hopefully there will not be a raid to end my life. This was supposed to be a, a victory lap. A uh, time where I, oh, I'm just going to go out there and we're going to have an easy time murdering this damn mechs and then uh, we'll be ready to go. Four more hours. Okay, fine. I'll just stare at this damn dot for three more hours. The shuttle has arrived. Oh, wow. About freaking time. Do I need to do it myself? How about auto load? There you are. Somebody will get around to it, right? Break soul needs treatment, huh? You lost a freaking finger. Are you insane? You absolute morons. <laughs> you can freaking savages. One of them lost a damn finger. What the hell? Go over there to tend the geezer. Seems like you were in the middle of crafting me some excellent drugs. Get in there. I have break soul. Why is he so slow, though? Moving 25%. Because he's just cracked and right in the... Oh, because he's super wounded in the legs. That is just so dumb. <laughs> Prime ties tend to break soul and then tend to crack like that. What? Where are you going? Why are you grabbing that? Oh, because there's no medicine here because I'm dumb. Medical emergency. Death in 10 freaking hours. <laughs> From a freaking. Uh, <laughs> How did this get so disastrous? It was supposed to be the easiest quest of all time. Solar flare. Please just keep keep bringing over the the terrible things. That's, that's amazing. Uh, our okay. The lifters are loading the damn prisoners into the damn place. Uh, yes, the geezer. The old person with the gas mask is going to treat some wounds in the complete darkness with his frail, 
dementia or all the terrible nonsense. I just still 70%. That's pretty decent. All right, please. One hour. 0.8 hours. 0.7 hours. 0.5 hours. 0.4 hours. Four seconds. Do it. This is so dumb. Lost a damn finger in a social fight. The, the absolute savage just clamping down with her teeth. Freaking pieces of garbage. Dermeister should be there. Dermeister is just completely done. <laughs> My apologies, Dermeister. You have been lost to incompetence. Absolute incompetence. One of the most shameful displays of my entire Rim World career, I had no experience. That is the problem. I had no experience assaulting a place. Oh, there's a needle over there. Let's go over here. Oh, there's also a scyther. Did they recover? Very possible they recovered. Buddy, this is this is rough. I'm not going to deploy my low shield. But this is uh, problematic, that's for sure. Okay, everybody just release the animals. Murder that Tesseron. Attack the damn Scyther. Holy crap, man. I think damage don't get burnt. Please, Hike, don't get your entire face just chewed off by a freaking Scyther. All right, the Tesseron is done, right? The Tesseron had gone down. And it's like everything recovered. Everything recovered. I, I did not realize it worked that way. Well, my poor elephants. Holy crap. I refuse to set off my shield. This threat is not worth the damn shield. But Hike is going to solve this problem. This damn needle monster needs to be put down by her incredible power of destruction. Murder the fire monsters. There you go. Murder the other fire monster. No! <laughs> Holy crap. Did she actually do this? Tell me the log. Murder the thrust did it. I thought that high cut just absolutely obliterated that monster, but it, it didn't. Ah! Okay, all right. All oh, the damn, all the damn evil mechs are dead. Get out of there, grave digger! Freaking ridiculous! <laughs> Poor bastards! <laughs> oh, please. Extinguish fire. There you go. We do need to s extinguish the fire on this elephant. Come on, grave digger. My goodness. Break soul craft the cannon no longer incapable of walking. Okay, well well done. You absolute morons. Attack there. We're going to break our way in for some... Re oh, what is that? Guinea pigs. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. Bunch of guinea pigs. Let me attack my way in. It's silly to use the front door. Holistic stock of this disaster. Kind of a scyther blade. Okay, it's not bad. It's the animals that got it pretty bad. <laughs> oh, what a freaking nightmare. Come on, open the door. We have found the problem solver. What a gorgeous weapon over there. Mm, who shall wield it? I don't even know. It is a short range weapon. You don't want to give it to just anybody. What are you with? Just a heavy SMG normal? T Rose, you're the chosen one. Extract the problem solver. Alright, this is open. Let me. Oh, that was outrageous. I really underestimated like there's no there's no way around it. I underestimated the crap out of this encounter. I thought it would be a pretty trivial thing. There you go. Tiros has extracted the problem solver. Put them down though. 
and you can now equip the problem solver. There you are, and pick up the SMG. And uh, why well, pick it up? That makes no sense. All right, get me here. Get me out of here. Can I deconstruct this? It's probably like, uh, probably has gold in it, right? A relic quarry. Blargo, can you quickly? No relic to install, huh? Already deconstructing. Huh? Let's see how long it takes, because we do want to get the hell out of here. We can wait that long, right? It'll be fine. It should not be just limestone. Usually they are built with gold and stuff. You know, it makes sense to... Yeah, look at that. 37 gold. Totally worth it. Get the hell out of here. Jeebus, that was awful. I hated every minute of it. <laughs> My, our first loss... Quite the tragedy. Our first loss of a colonist, very anticlimactic too, is like <laughs> he was there one moment and gone the next. Pretty pathetic. Okay, looking good. Send. Quest completed. Man, we did we pay dearly for that problem solver. Thought it was an easy breezy lemon squeezy. Alright, well. We do have 37 gold to trade for whatever they have, the hell they have. Pretty sure it's all trash anyway. Yeah, this is just ass. There's no reason to buy any of this trash. Go away, you filthy savages. And we're just sleeping on the floor, huh? All right. Stupid solar flares. They're so dumb. There goes Lego. Oh, let's watch her in action. Look at that. Incredible mining action. She's actually pretty ass at mining, but you know, extremely passionate. She'll get there. Inspire recruitment on Blargo. Incredible. Did we load? Holy crap, I had sent it. Hey, awesome. What was it? What was the reward? It better be amazing. Tech Prof, Supersona, Supersona Core, and an Aquatic Leg, that's right, we definitely want, that is an awesome get, I have forgotten how good that is, I completely forgot too, that hey, Megal, how about you use the skill trainer on mining, hey, we have our, there you go, level 13, awesome, we have our mining specialist, we have some decent mechs, maybe, we're going to gestate ourselves a tunneler 25 plasteel yeah we got these things yeah yeah i eventually will get around to it uh insert tubo there you go the scan it leaves them with a bit of a sickness but it's really not that big a deal it's not uh, a massive problem to scan your own colonies as opposed to you know the next level of mech which m means actually murdering somebody. <laughs> it's not not very conducive. Not very conducive to uh, the longevity of your colonists if you scan their brains until it gets ripped apart. Not really a reason to go over here for wood. Gold is nice. Only seven people. And it's, it's filthy savages. Infection on Ephendamus. It's all right. Blargo is there to treat it, so it should be 100% safe. Let me make sure I see it, though. Yeah, he'll be fine. Yeah, got a bunch of burns. That was awful. Wow, that was hell. But thankfully, we made it happen. Brixel is starving. How about you go eat, dumbass? <laughs> what, a, what a crazy problem to have. Hey, the caravan's arrived. Gravedigger needs treatment? Oh, because of an infection, huh? How are you doing, the infection? It's fine. Do Itakin, Itakin have higher power of healing infections? Because that infection healing when was extremely high. Anyway, we have now one of these. Tech prof, sub, tech prof, sub persona core, and that means that it instantly you instantly get the research, 
So probably we'll click on multi-analyzer and get that research, or maybe geothermal. Let's just get instant geothermal power. Let's do it. Do that, and then we grab Break Soul. Use Tech Prof Super Sona Core. Geothermal power. <laughs> What's <Well, it's> easy? <laughs> All right. Awesome. You were getting gene processor, yeah. Uh, and now we're able to benefit from all the all the geothermal geysers. There's five in here. We're probably not even going to get around to these because we have our mining specialist. We're going to gestate one of these scumbags, one of the miners, and that is our cue to leave this damn place. Go find ourselves a nice underground base. I don't know where I want to go. It'll have to be kind of nearby. Do we have any allies right now? <laughs> I cannot trade with a single one of these morons. So, you know, my decision is not even based on, oh, who's close enough to trade with? Nobody, because I cannot trade with anybody. I think one of the savages I can trade with, but they're nowhere to be seen here. I think these guys... Minus 22 at a neutral. That is trading capable, but, you know, it's just not even worth it. Oh, there's the neutral faction right there. Ter... Teth... The... Ter... Teth... The... Holy crap, what a name. The... The Ter... The Tards. How about the Tards with Bodinium? So it will be a matter of going down that way. We can follow this road. But there's not a whole lot of mo mountains there. Maybe follow this road, pass through all here, and get ourselves a mountain base somewhere along this river. Mountainous, I like that. And then you can go through the road and you'll have enough to be able to travel all the way down here, going through all the pirate sites and all that stuff. That seems pretty interesting, I like this style. I like this style. Maybe I should get that mod that allows you to see a preview. Do I want the one with the river? Or do I want the one without the river? I would like to see the creek. I like that. I mean, the worst that can happen is we just abandon that colony too and we go one tile over, yeah, you know? So I think that may even happen in the next episode. I don't know how soon I want to do it. We're going to do it soon-ish. I just don't know exactly... When are we going to embark into that? Because, you know, moving... What's this? Oh. Sure. Autoload. It shall be done. Uh, now you, I have no idea what you're about. <laughs> Protecting a friend, is that it? Yeah, we did this. And then you get an orbital bombardment targeter and a psychic insanity land. That, was that worth it? I don't think it was. <laughs> <laughs> this guy started like 20 social fights. He was a total drag in my resources. He was a piece of trash is what he was. Uh, I would like to get Effin Dam. How is Effin Damas doing with this uh, infection? I don't like this. Effin Damas. Shadow is loaded with cargo. Off you go. Um, nice. Very nice. Somebody can equip that. I don't care. And hopefully somebody equips that. I don't know who we will, but they, they have a tendency to just grab it. Somebody will do it, and I'm not really picky who's going to do it. If in Damas, where are you up to? You're just playing some chess. How about you go down here, rest into your hill, and then a hike can... Uh, preach health. Do you need it, though? How about you get some bed rest? You'll be fine. Tendency expires soon. How about you get tended? Uh, because I would like to use the conversion. Who was it? It was Dregs, right? Yep. Hike. Are you doing okay? You're fine. Where's Dregs? Where is Dregs? He's having a meal. Go convert Dregs. Must be very close, too. With that 35% mid there. Certainly goes up so quickly. It's annoying as hell. Okay, 11%. Sweet. Resents it. I don't give a crap. You're going to convert to our cult or else we have a freaking raid of Neanderthals. Never underestimate Neanderthals. 
because they are hardy as hell. They will refuse to break under a lot of heavy fire. So they are annoying to deal with. This uh, has been quite the eventful episode. That was a painful ordeal. Dermeister paid the price of my ignorance. Just abandoned forever to the devices of the mechanoids. Uh, who knows what kind of Borg nightmare abomination they created. Uh, we may get a chance to rescue him at some point. It's, I'm pretty sure that the game has like a built-in mechanic where you have... Uh, uh, eventually there will be a quest to go to go get him. So that makes it really interesting. I, I really like that. How many? Ah, oh, it's just ten. We can definitely dispatch these filthy savages without much trouble. We'll just have to draft everybody, bring them up here, and then just gun them down from a distance, and then stutter step back to the cover. It's going to be a great time in the next episode.